what up guys welcome back to another episode on plants vs zombies garden warfare 2 and now i'm back uh now this video i started off with because i am level 10 with this character as you see in the bottom left i am level 10 now i've heard and i've known about look at this this is it lights up that means you gotta go to here and you choose character promotion promotion and you choose your tank commander now I don't know what happens when I do this. I'm gonna show you guys what happens. Promoting will reset your tank commander level to one. You will be rotted with a new title and character plague. Okay, nice one. Do it. I am a specialist. So what does that mean? Can can it be shown somewhere? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I know if you kill someone, if you see on the bottom left, it looks like a bronze uh, metal kind of thingy. When you see it, my level one. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna go to customization. Maybe something happened right there. Maybe I unlocked something. Let's see. Customization appearances. Nothing here. Maybe a new character upgrade. Nothing. Okay. No. Okay. So there's no customization that you get from ranking. You do get like the nice, um, nice bronze thingy when you're level. Um, when you get killed or when you kill somebody uh, they see your name and it will say above it like specialist that means that you're you know a specialist that's pretty cool um, what else did I want to show you guys I wanted to show you guys about the stars uh, I told you guys yesterday what the stars could do and I'll be going outside this map I got 12 stars right now so I'll be walking over to somewhere where I can open a chest let me go down into the sewers again that looked like a very nice spot to open some bullshit so after this I will probably play one game of gnome bombs just to show you guys a bit of gameplay and this is a chest it opens seven stars now let's see what's in there you get a lot of money and you get a backyard a classy fountain so that's pretty nice you get that uh, it's also as I told you a lot of customization on the map itself it's pretty cool. Uh, I I didn't think about. I, I didn't know that something like that would it be something in a game. Uh, I don't. It's nothing that. It's something major. It's just a little customization. It's nothing that big, but you know they still did it. What else would you do with the uh, stars? I don't think you can do anything else but open chests and do those, do those things. So um, there is supposed to be something around here that I could buy, but I don't know where it it's at. Maybe it's this. No, it's not that. Um, oh, collect gnome. Oh, nice. Well, I don't actually know where this is at, but uh, you see, you'll see in a second. Okay, so I'm actually on the plant side now, and you can see it's clean rubble. So I'm gonna do that, and oh, that's a nice a customized. Oh, you can choose which statue. Well, I already unlocked the Asian Dave one, so I can put that one there. And this probably will be something too. Okay, but I only have three, uh, two skip stars left, so. Well, not skip stars, just no, uh, normal stars left, so. I won't be able to do anything with those. Uh, let me open up the packs. I, I saved up some money. I got 180,000. Well, in this game, you actually get quite a lot of money, so that's pretty nice. You get a lot of stuff in this in this game so you get your different kind of ways to earn money so you could you should and be able to get a lot of coins really really fast look at this another customization backyard item oh that's another one the ruby kind uh, the ruby guy oh no not that one I will be opening the pa the plants once uh, the most because I I think the plant team is the more dominant one in this game uh, the rose character, the the wizard rose, um, I didn't I didn't feel like it was that good, but it's been used online very much, and I've been killed by it many many times. So I think that character is probably the one that is the best to use. Well, excuse me, I don't want to say that it's the best to use, but you know, it kills me hell a lot, and it kills you pretty fast. It shoots really fast, and what's this? Some nice popcorn stuff. Uh, this is the ice. Okay, so that is for the packs that I had. Uh, I I kind of wasted all my money, but that's the point of this game. You're supposed to waste your money. And now let's get in that, into a game of some gnome bomb. 
Okay, so we found a game, and I will try and show you guys a bit of the sleepy bunny of the wizard. Uh, I've uh, I found this. I found this uh, guy, or you know, it's not a girl. That's like, it's not a guy. But I found this uh, player, a character, to be the more dominant one in this, in this game. So uh, I got nothing left, no abilities. So I've got the time snare that kind of, it kind of you know slows down any player. Then I've got the the triangle kind of burst thingy. I can explode a bit, and I. With R1, I can turn a someone into a goat. Now let's try and do a couple of everything, and I'll show you guys whenever it worked out. So let's see if we can win some gun battles. Uh, is this, I don't know. I, I'll probably won't be that good with it. I got a nice vanquish right there, trying to get out of this position. So, at the point of Gnome Bomb is really that uh, there are three, you know, bomb places on every side. You got three ones you got to defend, and we got the three that you can attack. And there will spawn a gnome in the middle of the map where you have to pick the gnome up. Your team has to pick it up and go to one of their bases to put them down. Oh, shit, I didn't see that little end there. And you try and explode those uh, those three statues that they have uh, to win the game. As you can see on the upper part of the feet of the screen, we've killed two of them statues. So we just we, uh, we destroyed two of the statues, and we have to do one more to win this. We got 12 minutes to do that, and we haven't lost any statues. So that's pretty nice. So we've just armed the last statue. So we're about to win this game, I think. Uh, let's turn someone into a go. Is that possible? I don't know actually how it works to really, you know, do that. But we're kind of spawn trapping them now. That's not that nice, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, and we do win this game, so that's pretty nice too. Uh, we did manage to win this game, and I will probably end off this uh, this episode with that being said. So, uh, Gnome Bomb is a very chaotic game mode so I don't play it that much but I do have a quest for it that's why I'll probably jump on it for a couple of times just to win that stuff but besides that I don't I won't I won't ever play it again unless there are quests to do it and to get my XP multiplier up so but with that being said this will be the episode uh, for today or for now so I hope you guys enjoyed it leave a like if you like the video subscribe if you want to see more of this series I really like playing this game and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.